In today's digital landscape, every company relies on cloud service providers. However, operating in the sphere of cloud computing is challenging. In contrast to traditional services, the majority of cloud providers share the same characteristics. The top three cloud providers are Amazon Web Services, Microsoft Azure, and Google Cloud. And AWS is one of the largest cloud providers amongst them. So, are you guys looking to get AWS certified? Or have you already made a decision but don't know where to start? You are exactly in the right place. Hello everyone and welcome to this session. Today we'll explore all about the AWS certifications. Before we begin, please consider subscribing to our YouTube channel and hit the bell icon to stay updated on the latest tech content from Edureka. Also, visit the Edureka's website for training and certification courses on AWS, the link to which is given in the description box below. So, without any further delay, let's begin right away with what is AWS. AWS is like a super power computer that you can access over the internet. It provides a wide range of services like storage, computing power, and databases so that individuals and businesses can run their applications and store their data without needing to buy and maintain their own hardware. It is a kind of like renting a really powerful computer in the cloud instead of owning one yourself. AWS empowers businesses and individuals to build, deploy, and manage applications and services without the need for upfront infrastructure investment, enabling agility, innovation, and cost efficiency in the digital era. Further, let's move with what is AWS certification. AWS certification validates expertise in the Amazon Web Services, crucial for cloud computing roles. It offers certifications tailored to different skill levels and roles including architects, developers, and administrators. Preparation involves self-study or instructor-led training, followed by a rigorous exam covering AWS services, best practices, and real-world scenarios. Certified professionals demonstrate proficiency in designing, deploying, and managing cloud solutions, enhancing career prospects and earning potential. For organizations hiring AWS certified staff, accelerates cloud initiatives, improves operational efficiency, and encourages innovation. AWS certification is recognized as a mark of excellence in driving success in the rapidly evolving cloud computing landscape. Next, let's explore the key benefits of holding an AWS certification and how it can accelerate career growth, enhance credibility, unlock new opportunities in the dynamic and fast-paced world of cloud technology. Holding an AWS certification offers several key benefits, like you can get a better jobs. With an AWS certification, you become more attractive to employers seeking professionals with the cloud computing skills. It opens doors to the job opportunities in the various industries, as many organizations use AWS for their IT infrastructure needs. Higher salary potential Employers are willing to pay higher salaries to the AWS certified professionals due to the specialized knowledge and expertise they bring to the table. Certification validates your proficiency in AWS services, making you eligible for better paying roles within the tech industry. Next comes enhanced credibility. Holding an AWS certification boosts your credibility within the industry and among peers. It serves as a proof of your dedication to mastering the AWS technologies, earning the trust of the employees, colleagues, and clients who value certified professionals for their expertise. Networking opportunities. Connecting with other AWS certified professionals through the forums, events, and online communities provide networking opportunities and access to valuable insights and resources. Job security. As cloud computing continues to gain the prominence, the demand for AWS certified professionals remains high. Holding an AWS certification can provide a job security and stability in a rapidly evolving industry. Access to exclusive resources AWS certified professionals often gain access to exclusive resources, such as job boards, training materials and events provided by the AWS and its partners, further enhancing their skills and knowledge. Competitive advantage in a competitive job market, holding an AWS certification sets you apart from the other candidates. It shows your dedication to staying with the current industry trends and your ability to hold AWS services effectively. The certifications are organized into different levels and tracks, 
each catering to specific roles and proficiency levels. Let's explore the levels of AWS certification and their significance in the world of cloud technology. There are 11 AWS certificates, one foundational level, three associate level, two professional level, and five specialty level certificates. First comes foundational level. The initial stage on the way of AWS certification is known as foundational level. It deals with the basic concepts of AWS cloud and is more suitable for the freshers. At this level, there is only one certification, AWS Cloud Practitioner. This certification is specially meant for individuals with a basic understanding of AWS Cloud Platform. In order to sit for this exam, you should have ideally worked in Amazon Web Services for at least 6 months. The exam contains 65 questions of either multiple choice or multi-response with a time duration of 90 minutes and it costs 100 US dollars to take this exam. Next in the list comes associate level. To obtain an associate level, you are required to have a comprehensive depth and breadth of knowledge in a particular domain, whereas the level of difficulty of the exam is also higher than the foundational level. In this level, there are three certificates. First comes AWS Certified Solutions Architect. This certification program is intended for the people over one year experience in creating distributed software systems and solving problems using these system implementations on AWS. In order to receive such certificate, one must show his or her competence in creation of different types of programs as well as their management and deployment with respect to AWS. This exam covers the following aspects. Knowledge of architecture and deployment of applications on AWS. Solution giving abilities using architectural design principles. Implementation guidance throughout the entire life cycle, etc. The exam contains 65 questions of either multiple choice or multi response with a time duration of 130 minutes and it cost 150 US dollars to take this exam. Next certificate is AWS Certified Developer. This credential is aimed at people who have 12 month experience in developing application utilizing AWS. Gaining this certificate requires that you have sound programming knowledge as well as deep understanding of core AWS services and basics of AWS architectural principles. Furthermore, you also need to know about the development, deployment and debugging processes of cloud-based applications along with the various other related concepts. Same as other exams, this exam also contains 65 questions of either multiple choice or multi-response with the time duration of 130 minutes and it also takes 150 US dollars to take this exam. Next comes AWS Certified SysOps Administrator. This credential has been designed for the professionals who have been in the industry for at least one year and are experts in deploying and operating on AWS. This certification exam evaluates skill sets such as deploying and managing applications on the AWS platform, transferring data between data centers and AWS, selecting appropriate AWS services for an organization based on its needs. The exam contains 65 questions of either multiple choice or multi-response with a time duration of 130 minutes and it cost 150 US dollars to take this exam. Advancing, we have professional level. It's highly recommended to have substantial hands-on experience with AWS services, a solid understanding of cloud architecture principles, and familiarity with the topics covered in the exam blueprint. While holding an associate level certification can be beneficial, but it's not at all mandatory. At this level, there are two certifications. First comes AWS Certified Solutions Architect. Few years ago, before attempting this particular exam, you were supposed to do the associate level exam for this track. The reason was to make sure that you had enough information about how architecturing is done in AWS before getting into deep certifications. But last October 2018, AWS removed this ruling to provide customers a more flexible approach to the certifications. This certification is designed for those individuals who have at least two years of experience as a solutions architect in the cloud industry. The certification is more concerned with the assessment of what cloud computing means, how much data it can take compared to other types of networks. The exam contains 75 questions of either multiple choice or multi-response with a time duration of 180 minutes 
and the exam fee is 300 US dollars. Lastly, we have AWS certified DevOps engineer. Before, it was generally recommended by AWS that before taking this certification, you should have already attended and successfully completed both AWS SysOps Administrator Associate and AWS Developer Associate exams. Reaching to professional level used to require first obtaining the associate level certifications. Again, this rule was removed by the AWS to provide customers a more flexible approach to the certifications. This certificate marks your career in DevOps within AWS at its peak. This is designed for the individuals who have extensive experience with the AWS services and DevOps practices. Aiming to validate their advanced skills in designing and managing AWS solutions at scale. The exam contains 75 questions of either multiple choice or multi response, with a time duration of 180 minutes, and it costs 300 US dollars to take this exam. Lastly, we have specialty level. This is an advanced certification offered by Amazon Web Services for individuals who have advanced skills and knowledge in specific technical areas within the AWS ecosystem. As of my last update, there were several specialty certifications available, each focusing on different areas of expertise. Let's see each one of them. AWS Certified Advanced Networking Essentially, this pathway focuses on creating and servicing network architectures within the AWS software environment and utilizing core AWS services for networking functions. You are also recommended to have at least 5 years of experience with the architecture and implementation of network solutions. The exam contains 75 questions of either multiple choice or multi response with a time duration of 170 minutes and the exam fees is 300 US dollars. Next in the list comes AWS certified security. This validates your expertise in security domain in AWS. You are recommended to possess industrial experience of at least two years of securing AWS workload, along with the experience of a minimum five years in designing and implementing security solutions in the IT sector. To prepare, candidates should study the official exam guide, review AWS white papers and documentation, enroll in relevant training courses, and get hands on experience with the AWS security services. The exam contains 65 questions of either multiple choice or multi response with a time duration of 170 minutes and it costs 300 US dollars to take this exam. Next is AWS certified machine learning. This certification validates your expertise in development, implementation and maintenance of machine learning solutions with AWS cloud. To earn this certification, you are recommended to have one or two years of experience in the development and architecture of machine learning or deep learning workloads on the AWS clouds. To prepare, candidates should thoroughly study the official exam guide provided by the AWS, enroll in specialized training courses, and get a hands-on experience by working with AWS machine learning services. This exam also contains 65 questions of either multiple choice or multi responses with a time duration of 170 minutes and it costs 300 US dollars to take this exam. Next is AWS certified database. This certification validates your expertise in designing and maintenance of AWS database solutions as per the requirements. You are recommended to have at least 5 years of industrial experience with the database technologies along with a minimum of two years experience on AWS. You also need to have some hands-on experience with the AWS cloud-based relational and non-relational databases. This exam also contains 65 questions of either multiple choice or multi-response with a time duration of 170 minutes and it costs 300 US dollars to take this exam. And the last one is AWS Certified Data Analytics. This certification validates your expertise in data analytics and the ability to design and model big data solutions using AWS services. You are recommended to have an experience of at least 5 years with the data analytics technologies along with the 2 years of hands-on experience on the AWS platform before appearing for this certification exam. This exam contains 65 questions of either multiple choice or multi-response with a time duration of 170 minutes and 
the exam fees is 300 US dollars. Now, I know most of you are wondering how to choose the right certificate. Let me help you. Choosing the right EWS certification begin with a clear understanding of your career goals, current skill set and professional interest. For beginners, AWS Certified Cloud Practitioner offers a broad understanding of AWS basics. Associate level certifications are ideal for those with some experience in the specific roles. Specialty level certifications like AWS Certified Security cater to advanced skills in specialized areas like security or machine learning. Consider your career aspirations, job roles, and industry demand to select the most suitable certification path for you. Next, let's move to job roles and salaries of AWS Certified Professionals in India. The job roles and salaries of AWS Certified Cloud Practitioner in India can vary based on several factors such as location, experience, specific AWS certifications, and organization itself. However, let me give you a general review. Cloud Support Engineer As a Cloud Support Engineer, you will be responsible for assisting customers with their AWS infrastructure, troubleshooting issues, and providing technical support. Salaries can range from 4 lakh to 9 lakh per annum for entry-level positions. Cloud Consultant Cloud consultants work closely with the clients to design, deploy, and manage AWS cloud solutions tailored to their business needs. Salaries for this role can vary widely based on their experience and expertise, ranging from 6 lakh to 20 lakh per annum, or higher for the senior positions. SysOps Administrator They are responsible for managing and maintaining AWS cloud environments ensuring their availability, security, and performance. Salaries typically range from 5 to 15 lakh per annum. DevOps Engineer DevOps engineers focus on automating the deployment, scaling, and management of applications on AWS infrastructures. Salaries for DevOps engineers in India can start from 6 lakh and go up to 25 lakh or more based on experience and expertise. Solutions Architect AWS Solutions Architects design and implement AWS solutions that meet business objectives while considering factors like scalability, security, and cost effectiveness. Salaries for Solution Architects can range from 8 lakh to 30 lakh per annum or higher for the senior positions. It's important to note that these figures are approximate and can vary based on the factors like candidate skill sets, geographic location, and company size. Additionally, obtaining higher level AWS certifications or gaining expertise in specific AWS services can significantly impact the salary levels. So, are you ready to learn about AWS? Want to understand how to build and manage cloud-based solutions easily? With Edureka simple and interactive courses, you can become an AWS expert in no time. Interested in boosting your career with valuable skills? Join us today and start your journey towards success. With this, we have come to an end of this session. Hope this session was informative. Thank you and happy learning. I hope you have enjoyed listening to this video. Please be kind enough to like it and you can comment any of your doubts and queries and we will reply them at the earliest. Do look out for more videos in our playlist and subscribe to Edureka channel to learn more. Happy learning!